It's time to cover an avatar I always wanted to cover and even have worn this avatar in my recent video. So let's take a look together and check out the Runa avatar in VR. Ah, Runa. You probably have seen this avatar on VR chat for some time now. No? You didn't? If not, then you might know this person. Tapa, the head of community, who usually wears this type of avatar. I actually decided to also make myself a custom runa, but before we get into this topic a little more, what the fuck is a runa? Runa is a robotic anime style of avatar created by Tori Nan, an avatar creator on Booth who is known for more suspicious avatars, if you know what I mean. But besides this fun fact, Tori Nan has created many interesting and well-made avatars specifically for the Archer, and one of them is runa. Runa costs you 7,000 yen or 50 US dollars depending on the conversion rate and already comes with some great features like removable parts, hue shift which lets you change the color of your hair and physics bones of course. Torinian themselves are actually creating compatible assets for Runa specifically which is actually quite rare to see coming from an avatar creator on booth. Some assets are sock set with different patterns, a horn set, different type of legs that you can change, a complete industrial set with completely different hair, completely different body type, a paw set that you can add different types of clothing, different hairstyles, a complete and almost transparent endoskeleton and a chibi version. Also a very great point to mention is that Runa is also quest compatible. Yes, there is a quest compatible version that you can purchase. This is all really crazy and a lot of stuff you can change and play around with but what makes Runa so special that I create a specific video about it? Runa is not your simple booth VRChat avatar. As you might have seen already, Runa is a robot. Usually VRChat robot avatars don't really match the vibe or just simply look overall blocky and forced but runa is a completely different creation here not only is it customizable and quest compatible but it is also the first actual robot anime like avatar that you can purchase on booth.pm overall runa has so much potential when it comes to customization and its use in the virtual world now does that convince you to become a runa well my friend i'll let you know right now but don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to support this channel if you're watching my avatar series pretty actively then you might know my answer to this if not then let me explain. One option that I highly recommend and prefer is to actually purchase Runa and specific assets to create your own custom version of this avatar and also support the creator Torinian as well. The other option is... Oh. Prismix Avatar Search. This is a world where you can look for specific avatars and can choose between a variety of versions depending on what you're looking for. You might want to check out how this avatar feels at first and if you're actually feel comfortable with it and if that's the case go ahead and support the creator by purchasing the avatar. Overall, Runa is pretty unique. The first actual robot anime styled avatar that you can get on booth with a lot of accessories to choose from and some of them even made by the avatar creator themselves. Runa is a good example of trying out new things when it comes to avatar creation and wearing an avatar in general. So should you be a robot anime styled avatar and be able to shine in freshly baked metal for the rest of your VR playtime? Absolutely yes. Bye! Thank you.